Uh, what did I refrain from doing to to leave? What was it? What did I What did I do to do to be at the level of success that I am? Pretty much what I did to be at the level of success that I am today is get rid of all the negative and bad influence around me. And by negative and bad influence, I don't mean the typical criminals, but I mean the simple things from people not supporting you nor helping you out. People who encourage you and tell you that school isn't worth it, that you're wasting your time, you're wasting money, that you shouldn't do your homework because it's not worth it. Well, to me, it's worth, it's worth everything. I've sacrificed a lot, sacrificed family time, I sacrificed alone time, I sacrificed a couple of my friends, I've lost connections just because I care a lot about school. I'm not saying to get rid of everything around you, but I'm saying be focused. And with that, I'm really focused and I'm not going to let one little person, another, even a big group of per people tell me that what I'm doing is a bad thing because in reality, I know what I'm doing is right. It's going to lead me to what I want to do, to what I love. And um, it was just a little bit of motivation and uh, discipline and uh, to reach my goals and dreams. There's nothing could stop me. That was the one. Uh, the second one was, uh, what, what did I... What goal did you focus on? What, goal did, what did you focus on to graduate? Okay. The main goal that I tried to focus while in school was pretty much being focused. There was I went to a private school and most people, especially adults, they believe that private school is good and nothing bad happens. And in true reality, it's probably pretty much one of the worst. You know, we might not have a lot of fights, but behind the scenes, there's a lot of bad things that goes on. There's uh, from drug shrinking, underage, all this stuff. And pretty much that's nothing that I want to be a part of. It's too much, it's too risky. It's not even worth my time. And just being focused and not caring about what goes around. Just just do my work, do my homework, do get good grades on my quizzes, tests, and pretty much being one of the top students in my classes at this private institution. It pretty much led me to being uh uh graduating and uh Oh, wait, I didn't graduate from that school. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. It pretty much led me to being one of the top students in my class. There you go. And uh, the third one was, uh, what was the third one? A definitive moment in your high school or, or in school that helps you get where you need to be. Like something that happened that was special to you. Okay. Really to be. A definitive moment in my life. Well, pretty much nothing bad really happened in my, in my school life. Nothing... Nothing big happened while I was in school. Pretty much the one moment that decided everything that I wanted to do, it was late in, the, in my high school years, but that's when I knew what I was going to do was for the right purpose. And that was pretty much my grandpa passing away. I'm not saying that him passing away was a, a good thing, but it really gave me a lot of motivation. One of his last words on my, uh, uh, to me was, uh, 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 Give it all that you got. I didn't have the same education, but I know that you will. And that really motivated me. And when him, when him passing away, it was a huge hit to me because he really supported me. He really encouraged me because he had nothing. He went from being um, someone who was uh, borderline poverty to having the American dream, fulfilling this business that he wanted to. And he wanted me to succeed just like him. And uh, I remember at, my, at his funeral, uh, you know, people got to speak. And really, pretty much no one spoke. I was one of the very few. And up there, I pretty much gave my testimony. That I, in four years, it's been one year, but I said in four years, I'll come back with my degree and give it to him. It's not for me, it's for him. What I'm doing, I'm, I'm here to make him proud. I finished. A two-year a two-year program in one year. I'm only 19 years old. I'm already a junior at the University of Las Vegas. And with that being said, I got I got one more year, two more years ago, and then I'm bringing back the degree to Sacramento.